I paid a professional artist to redesign the 16 personality types. And this is the outcome. Okay, let's be real for a second. First of all, let's admit that the avatars that we are currently using for the 16 personality types suck. I mean, no offense. With their button-shaped empty eyes that stare straight into your soul with nothing behind them, I feel that the current 16 personality art avatars, honestly, uh, are slightly soulless and cold and don't really give and paint the 16 personalities justice. So I thought we should make some new ones. So starting with the NFs, because I couldn't really afford all of them at once, um, I wanted to see what's possible and I wanted to see what an artist could do with the 16 personality types. Now first of all, a small disclaimer, this artist had no idea about the MBTI and was not familiar with the personality types. So I had to describe and give very specific instructions to the artist to make sure that they could really capture <laughs> the essence of what I thought the 16 personalities were. Now let's get right into it with starting with the ENFP personality type. My goal for the ENFP personality type was to create an open-minded avatar, an explorer peering over a cliff into the future, a person uh, with uh, open wide eyes and uh, warmth in their face and a happy expression because I wanted to capture the ENFP at their best Looking for new opportunities with extroverted intuition. I used purple because I think purple is a good color to represent extroverted intuition beyond that um, She added in really cool details to really give this character life and also make them seem very real and I love the special colored tints on their hair uh, top of the black hair, so I thought this one was just perfect. Now, second, uh, let's go to the INFP personality type. The INFP here <laughs> stands a bit like a hippie uh, with uh, dreamy eyes, thinking about different possibilities, butterflies swirling around them. This is a person, a dreamer in all their full might and glory and I really like and love this character. Uh, she is simply adorable and amazing and uh, I think really uh, captures like how beautiful and am amazing this personality type is and just how imaginative and this personality type can be. Now third, um, let's move to the ENFJ personality type. And this is my personal favorite. The ENFJ here looks like one of the most charming and adorable gentlemen uh, with this like theater circus style outfit and their cool masks ca uh, capturing the essence of extroverted feeling, their ability to take on different roles and personalities, their ability to act and their love for drama and theater. Uh, I feel this is an amazing personality type and honestly just um, an absolute charmer. Finally, <laughs> the INFJ. Um, and I'm gonna first show you the failed version and then I'm gonna show you the successful version. So uh, the first concept that I got for the INFJ I was really not happy with. You see here like a kind of Jafar-like creature. First of all she started drawing it with a goatee and then I said let's make it a full beard and then eventually I was like no no let's can you, can you just remake this completely because I don't feel like I want I want the more down-to-earth INFJ. I'm kind of done with the wizard INFJ avatar that we see in the 16 personalities. I just want to show a real face that INFJs can really relate to. So let's go with it, the real INFJ. This INFJ I feel like captures the creative and the visionary essence of the INFJ. It's a thinker and it's a person with a focused expression, trying to capture a concept and an idea in reality, carrying a book and a pen uh, to just like map out this ability to turn ideas to reality and their ability to imagine in high definition their ideas and to polish them into clear, crystal clear concepts. So yeah, that's it. Those are the NF archetypes. Let me know in the comments down below which your favorite was and don't forget to subscribe if you enjoy this kind of content. Of course all of these avatars are free to use so you can use them wherever. I'll share them in the link down below 
Um, so anyone is a bit allowed to use these in memes and future characters and uh, comics and memes. So yeah, just have fun with them. And uh, if you ever have cool art you want to share with me, always feel free to just send me a message because I love art and I love seeing these kind of things captured in visuals. That's all for today. Thank you so much for watching and see you all in the next video.